the Yankees in town. Is fun. this one a special series for you, or is it just like any other? Ah, man, I mean, it's, it's, I, I would, for me, I try to treat it like any other, but I think, you know, you'll see with the atmosphere tonight. I think the fans, obviously, Yankee fans travel well, so I think it'd be a little bit of a different atmosphere here. You're clearly pretty busy during batting practice, almost like a reunion of sorts. A lot of guys on the other side wanting to say hello to you. Some like that. You know, there's only one left that I played with, Guardy, you know, but uh, I have gotten a chance to get to know there's obviously a lot of players that are on the team. So um, I always pull from them, pull for them from afar, but uh, unfortunately I can't over the next few days. I was going to ask you, how much do you keep tabs on what the Yankees are doing? Not much, really. I mean, you hear it, obviously, with the headlines and everything, but I, I, you know, I got my hands full down here in Miami, so I haven't paid too much attention to them, but I, I know pretty much what's going on, but not the details. How is Derek Jeter, the CEO, different from Derek Jeter, the shortstop? I'm a little more patient, I think, right? Um, I'm lying. I have no patience. Uh, I, I think you, it's something you have to learn is to have a little bit of patience. You know, when you're a player, it's instant gratification or failure. You're winning or lose, and then now in this position you have to plan three four five years out down the road so that's probably been the biggest adjustment for me you mentioned the planning how is the process going for you I know when I spoke to you for the first time you were obviously making a lot of changes with the organization well I mean we're, we're always trying to get better I think we've made a little progress over the last few years um, we have a lot of uh, you know exciting young players especially in the pitching department but um, we have still got a long ways to go I mean, we're not where we want to be this year Especially when we went to the postseason last year. This year has been a, a disappointment, I think, for all of us. But uh, we're just constantly figuring out how we're going to get better. Are you enjoying the role? Not yet. <laughs> well, we got to win first. Do you miss playing at all? I don't. That I do not miss. I I, I, I was tired when I retired, so I don't miss playing. Uh, you know, I miss being up in New York. Obviously, you miss the fans. I've said it before. Yankee fans are the best. So you miss them, but uh, you run into Yankee fans everywhere. Yankees fans have had so many great moments with you over the years. Is there one moment that stands out to you in your Yankees career? I don't know if it's going to pick one. I mean, there's a lot of moments. I was blessed to have a lot of great experiences with the organization. We had a lot of success uh, team-wise, personal-wise. But, uh, you know, in the last game at Yankee Stadium is freshest and said it before it's the one game that didn't count actually but it just I think goes to show the relationship that I had with the Yankee fans so that's the thing that stands out the most right now you mentioned teammates one of your teammates is in our booth Paul O'Neill tonight any message for Paulie Paulie's still in the booth well he's I in his think, basement you know, he doesn't think, travel yeah, now. if you thought about it I, he was the last person I thought would be on TV talking about baseball when he played but no he's done a good job and uh, yeah we touch base from time to time and look forward to seeing him again soon now, you have a very special moment coming up in September. Have you worked on the speech yet? I haven't. You know, I, I just recently started writing down notes. Everyone kept asking me if I would started writing it, and I said no, and nobody believed me. But I guess I've been putting it off for a while, but i got to get to it because uh, we're a few weeks away. Hopefully, you know, the, the target keeps moving. Um, but, uh, yeah, I got, I've started writing down some notes, and I'm looking forward to it. Will that be a difficult speech for you to write because there have been so many people over the years that have played a role in, in your success in your career? You know, it's, it's impossible to thank everyone that's played a part in your career. I'll do my best. I apologize right now in advance if I forget anyone. But, um, yeah, it's a long career. I played professionally for 23 years, and there's a lot of people that helped along the way. What do you think you'll enjoy most about that day? Sharing it with family and friends, I mean, those are the ones that were with you or with me the entire ride, and um, I don't want to go into it with any preconceived notions. I think I just want to experience it, and uh, but it is something I think I'm looking forward to, but I think my family's looking forward to it even more so than me. Your family, they were staples at the stadium when you were playing. I have to ask you now, Marlins fans, or are they still Yankees fans? Both. You know, I, I think it's everyone asked me the question, like I have to choose, right? Uh, you know, we only play each other a couple times a year, but uh, you know, I still follow the team. I, I wish them the best, uh, just not when we're playing them. How meaningful is it to you that fans who are Yankees fans follow the Marlins, the national team, National League club because of you? Do they? Would well, tell them to come down here and buy some tickets and come out to some games. That might help us out. But that's good. You know, look, 
baseball fans, and you know, I learned a lot um, playing in the Yankee organization, and and uh, some of the values and the tradition and, and uh, the professionalism that they have. I want to bring down here with the organization. Donnie wants to do the same, right? So um, we're happy that they're paying attention, and when they come down to Miami, please come out to a game. Derek, thanks for the time, and early congratulations on your big day in September. Thank you very much. Good to see you.